Hey guys, welcome to today's video. Today we're making another Filipino dessert. So we'll be making leche flan. It's like a cream brulee. Mm, I used to have them at school. We used to have them in these little mm. pots and you have to tip them upside down and bang them. And then when you get it out, it's all like wobbly. Yeah, Try it's quite nice and um, it's very shiny. It's sweet, you know. But when you start eating it, you just can't stop. Yeah, it's very good. Mm. Yeah. Is it, it's got caramel or is it vanilla essence? It's vanilla. But um, people in the Philippines, they normally put it on like halo halo. Um, or on top of cake. Yeah, like cake. Ubi you cake can get like and then... A, you can get like a, a custard cake, ube custard cake, mm. anything, but yeah, it's amazing. So we'll probably start now. Yes. You only need four ingredients for this one. You need eggs, evaporated milk, condensed milk, and vanilla essence. Let's go. Okay, so we've gathered all our ingredients. We've got eight eggs because, did you say we're making six? Yeah. So we're making six lechi flans. Well, but hopefully, but depends on how much we put in on each container. Oh, okay. So we've got six, eight eggs, our evaporated milk, vanilla essence, and again, condensed this condensed milk is our favorite. But, um, for the eggs though, we need to get the, um, the egg yolk out of the egg whites and separate it and then we're not really going to use the egg whites at all no so let's start guys you need to show your skill so you did a GCSE cooking why do you always bring this up? I'm not a very good cook guys look at that I love it. Oh, oh no, cracked it! Oh, cracked no. it! Oh. Right, that's one done. Right, I've done like nearly half of this, Zoe. Well, someone had to film. Look at this concentration. Oh, crack it again. What are you doing? In there? <laughs> what are you doing? In there? I don't. I just forgot. <laughs> Silly, aren't you? Now we're all in a cross <laughs> hand. <laughs> oh, this bit won't drop. Is it not dropping? Go away. Go. <laughs> oh man, you're like a magnet. Ah, go on. Are you on? And you get lost. Go on, sorry. Come on, this egg white is like so attached to this yolk. Come on now, separate. Separate. Well, you're battling with that. Um... Oh, you've done it. Tapos. So I'm going to stop. Getting the evaporated milk ready. What even is evaporated milk? Evaporated milk. It's evaporated. Evaporated means gone, surely. So, one can. A whole can? A whole can. Wow. Remember, it's going to be sweet. Next, Tap condensed off. milk. Just so that I can scoop it out. Are you able to scoop it out for me? You scoop it out so that I won't eat it. Wow. Oh, look at that. 
Mm. Condensed milk is like a must in nearly every single Filipino dessert. Condensed milk. If you get milk. fruit salad, you have to put condensed milk in that. Do you know I, that? Even, That's so sweet. Don't you even put it on avocados? Oh. Weird. Oh. Avocados is savoury. Wow, there's just so much. It's like never ending. Go on, get it all out of there. There's so much, it's just never ending. A few inches later. Let's back in there. And then, time to mix it all. Forgot something. The electric whisk. Vanilla extract. Oh. Oh, that you're, you're Filipino. You should know. You should know your measurements. Wow, it's doing. It's doing like some kind of ke oh stop now. It was doing <laughs> like a chemical, chemical reaction. It was like woo. <laughs> it was like spinning itself around. Go on, Zoe. Just get the whisk in there. Remember Ooh, to we're a bit oh, far come, away. come come close a little bit. I'm gonna go on a low setting so it doesn't go everywhere. Face. <laughs> that was just one on the lowest setting. Oh my gosh. Go on. Oh, no, it's, not. it's going everywhere. It's going everywhere. <laughs> I can't have this. Alright, I'll do it. I'll do it. Why is it going everywhere I'll, I'll for do me? It. So now we need to, um, because you know the eggs, it has them little bits, so we need to um, <laughs> strain it. Do what? Strain? Drain? 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 Strain. What? Strain. Strain? <laughs> what? Have you hurt yourself? Have you got a strain? No, no, no. So now we're going to sieve it, apparently. I thought you only sieved dry yeah, just stuff. Just so that, um, to get all the lumpy out, so that when you... <laughs> the lumpy. So that when it's cooked. <laughs> to get the lumpy. So that when it's cooked. <laughs> There's um, no hard bits in it, you know? So if you want to hold that, I'm going to pour it in there. Slowly. Just so it's clear. Like, look, you, can you see that? That's the uh, from the eggs. Like. Okay. And again. Again? Yep, swap. Just so that it's completely smooth, so you don't want to um, some hard bits in it. Roger that. I think that should be fine though. So that's the uh, the filling done, and now we just need to get the caramelised sugar and uh, on this little container. Oh, so you need sugar as well? Yeah. You so said only four ingredients. <gasps> Five. Alright guys, so as you can see, the sugar has melted and I'm just spreading it around. I don't want it to go to the hot because um, cause it's sugar, it will stick. And I don't want to get it on my tongue as well. On your tongue? Tongs. <laughs> Good job. Look, as you can see, it's bubbling oh, now. There we go. Must be done. Yeah, I'm just spreading it around. I'm going to put it on the side and then let it cool down. Cool down. And then we're going to... Do a couple more. So as you can see, it's completely covered now. Lovely. Alright guys, as you can see, now it's um, getting cold. 
put it in the side. It started cracking. What's cracked? Oh, the, the, sugar. the sugar. Is that okay? Look, yeah. It looks very nice, isn't it? <laughs> and, um, is so, this how hard-boiled sweets are made? I think so, yeah. Because um, because it's hot, they normally just burn it mm. and then model it up, don't they? Mm. Shall okay. we... So now we're going to put the uh, the filling in into this, mm -hmm. cover it up with cling film, mm -hmm. and then um, steam it up. Wow. That's it. That's so good. Normally it takes about 20-30 minutes to... To cook, but depending on if you prick it, because we, me, I normally prick it, and if nothing comes back out, then it's cooked. If it does, then it's not cooked. Perfect. Let's get going. Whoa! Listen to the crack. Lovely guy. So now, because it's ready, we put the filling in. We just need to put clean film over it. Put it in this one of these containers for the for the steamer. Then yeah, then we'll just wait and get up to that. Which one this goes in? Does it matter which pot I put this in? No, no. One more, guys. Isa more. How do what? I say more? If I want to say one more, Isa. Isa pa. Isa pa. Isa more. Isa. Isa pa. Just gonna put this on top of the steamer. Wow, you've been busy over here. So you're boiling water in here. This is plastic on a hob. That's not plastic. Are you sure? Oh yeah, it's not plastic. <laughs> it looked plastic. I, I genuinely thought you were using like the bottom of the rice cooker. That's why. But the rice cooker's here, so I don't know. So this is going to steam it, right? Yes. Diba. Yes. Um, how long for? About 20 to minutes. So surely the bottom one will be done before the top one. That's so. That's it. Oh, so we're going to have to swap them around or something? No, no. Oh wow, there's a lid and everything. Ah, like the Tower of Pisa. Yeah. So now, guys, it's just a waiting game, and we'll probably come back in 30 minutes, and we'll let you know. Alright guys, we're gonna go for a hunt. There's something outside there. So <laughs> if you wanna follow me. Come on. Oh. <laughs> Count to ten. <sighs> Was it your funny bone? Mm-hmm. You should be laughing. Suck it. Alright. As you can see, there's some stuff here called electrofan. <laughs> And uh, they're just here, out here, just chilling in the cold. Yes, they are hibernating. Billis, Malamig? Hey, come. So, now, I'm gonna go and eat this lovely thing. So it's been setting outside, so it should be nice and cold. It is. Zar's now gonna flip it. Still flip. So I'm just gonna go around it. With the knife on the edges the so it doesn't stick. 
Oh, it's quite cold actually. Yeah, I know. It's like it's been in the freezer. Yeah, yeah I haven't done this for a while. So I'm quite worried. And um, the steamer, I never really used that steamer, that's a new one. So. Yeah. First time for everything. Just a little taste. Zah! You're bad. Very nice. Quality control, hey? Right, guys. You ready for the flip? Drum roll. You ready for the. I think look how thick that is but look at the syrup as well and it's shiny at the top can you see mm. all right for the taste what is it? let's see yeah look at that mm. Does it taste? Mm, very good. Is it? Mm-hmm. Mm. All right. Don't eat too much. <laughs> For but me, oh, the best bit is, it's not even, I mean, it tastes good, mm. but my favorite bit is like the feel of it. Yeah. Mm. Kind of, it's like a, what would, you, what would you call it, you think? What, this? The taste, like the, the texture. I'm just going to have to have some more to answer that question. <laughs> mm. It's kind of similar to the top of cheesecake. Uh, but oh, yes. smoother. Mm. And obviously a bit more stuck together. Yeah. Mm. Really good. Yeah. Mm. But yeah, guys. No, no, no. You need to try. Right. You know what? It tastes better because it's really cold. Mmm. Yummy. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Have some more good, hey? I missed that. Mm -hmm. It's literally my favourite. Have some Ever more. Since I... <laughs> Whoa! Do you want some more? No, no. Mm. But ever since I was little, this has always been my favourite pudding. It's so. really good. Next time, I want it on top of um. Oh, imagine maybe. having a yeah, an ube chiffon cake with that mm. chiffon on top. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But yeah, guys, that's the end of the vlog. Make sure to like and subscribe. Leave a comment down below. Yep. If we missed anything or any opinions about our amazing lecture flan, mm -hmm. just comment comment it down below. Oh my gosh, I'm literally eating half of this. So stop. I'm thirsty now. So we'll see you later guys, peace.